Time now to connect the dots when we make the news make sense. Dozens of companies in multiple countries racing to be the first to create a COVID-19 vaccine. But it turns out when this thing finally comes out, some healthy competition is not what we need. The race is on to find a vaccine for the coronavirus, but global competition to find one could spark another problem. Who gets it first? Let's connect the dots. There are close to 200 vaccines in development around the world, and researchers say at least two of them have produced immune responses in patients. Here's the problem, though. One of those is being worked on by British scientists. The UK has already paid for the first 100 million doses produced, and the US government has made a deal with Pfizer to get 100 million doses of its vaccine. This all works for countries that have money to invest in a massive undertaking like vaccine research, but there are a lot of countries that don't have those resources. But that's not just a problem for them. As we've learned, viruses don't respect borders. An ongoing outbreak in one country can be a threat to the entire world. Public health experts warn we need to come up with a plan to make sure everyone has access to a vaccine to end the threat to us all. And that is Connecting the Dots.